Welcome guys to another video. How are you doing? Welcome to a new month. Welcome to Vlogmas. So guys, it's December, Christmas, everyone is celebrating and gift giving. But Christmas is really about that, you know, the Lord God, Jesus died for us and he was born. But anyways, so it is Vlogmas and it's time to be happy and rejoice and today's video I'm going to show you how we make sorrel or Caribbean sorrel or Jamaican sorrel sorrel um, don't know if I'm going to add um, liquor to this because the liquor store is closed because of the, um, the pandemic so I'm going to try my best to see if I could get some alcohol for it if not it's just going to be sorrel drink so stay tuned, have a blessed holidays. Video. So today I'm going to make sorrel, um, which is a traditional um, sorrel in Christmas time. So um, it's from the hibiscus plant. See, they have a picture of the, the plant. So anyway, so this is the dried one. They have a fresh one that's sell in this, um, the West Indian store. So I got this from Walmart for $2.99. So I'm gonna use um, three of these. So I'm just going to wash them in some cold water and put it, um, I have some water with cinnamon, um, ginger and fermented seed boiling and then I'm going to let it soak for overnight and I will show you the finished product. So over here in the sink, I'm washing the um, sorrel, this is our, the color is already there so I'm just going to thoroughly wash them. And drain them off and then transfer it to the boiling water. So that's what I'm doing. Okay guys, so um, I was saying you can grate the ginger, um, but here I beat the ginger and I have some fermented seeds, cinnamon sticks and stuff. See this, it looks nice. Again, it's my first time. So here I have the sorrel, the dry sorrel, and I'm gonna add it to the water. So you can do um, how many packs you like to the portion of water to your liking. So just add one. Right, and I'm gonna add brown sugar after in it. So smells good, guys. Right. Again, it's a short video. This is sorrel. Normally, traditionally, they put rum, um, red label wine, or whatever you want to put in it. Um, but the Jamaican, I'm gonna put red label wine and white rum. Right, and maybe white rum and I'm going to leave it overnight and I'm going to come back and show you the finished product. Guys, for my first time, this looks amazing, nice and red just the way it's supposed to. I'm going to have it sit until tomorrow and then I'm going to sweeten it with my brown sugar. I don't know if the liquor store is going to be open, but if you're diabetic, just some sugar, brown sugar little bit or not or splendor or whatever you want to use but I'm gonna use brown sugar for me and the children and yeah you can add your red label wine and your rum and fix it up okay guys so this is my several drink guys this is the next day it smells really good it all it sat from yesterday all night and I'm going to strain it. I'm going to show you how I strain it. And I'm going to mix it with brown sugar. I went to the store. The store opened at 10 this morning. And I got some white rum, Ray Neveu. They don't have the red label wine. So I'm going to use 
I think wing carnis something I'll show you Ray and Nevu and the brown sugar and this is a much percent it is 18% alcohol so anyways guys I'm gonna get into the video and this dust the strainer and the brown sugar and here I have the white rum that I'm gonna be using they don't have the red label wine so I decide the next next best thing is this hair right and this is what I'm gonna use if you're not 18 years or older don't drink when I promote that but this is what I'm going to use to mix some of it right so persons that are diabetic don't have to sweeten it or they can use whatever sweetener that they want right and you don't have to use um, rum so this is what I'm using they don't everywhere is sold out of the bottle so yes guys this is what I'm gonna do stay tuned As you can see here, all the sorrel is coming out. It's nice and rich. I'm not gonna use it again. I don't know if persons use it again, but this is what I'm doing. And I'm gonna have my brown sugar and my white rum. Okay guys, so I'm going in with some brown sugar. Aiden is helping me to record, so. Show them the sugar, Aiden. Okay, so that's brown sugar. I'm not going to do a lot because put a lot of sugar. I'm going with one more brown sugar. Okay, and I'm gonna use a little bit of the other, is it wing carnage? Wine? Wing carnage one because I don't have the red label wine. I don't know how it tastes. So I'm not gonna put a lot, okay guys? And I'm gonna strain it again. I'm gonna just let you see how it looks. It smells good. And I'm gonna strain it and pour it out and let you see. Okay guys, so this is my final product of my sorrel drink. It tastes good to see you guys, my first time. So this is a traditional Jamaican sorrel drink. Yep. <laughs> I don't have the red label wine. Guys, so... <laughs> 